February is what month? February is reggae month. And worldwide, Jamaicans will be recognizing reggae month. To, um, to kick off re reggae month, the Consul General thought that we should get together and um, just mention that we need to be at a number of functions here in South Florida and internationally. Some of them will be on Zoom for this reggae month. So could I call upon the Consul General to say something about reggae month? Please give him a hand. Thank you very much, Mr. Higgins. Okay, so Reggae Month is so important um, to us as a people, not just in Jamaica, worldwide. Um, indeed, Reggae Month, Reggae has put Jamaica on the map. You agree? And so we here um, in this region, in the southern United States, specifically South Florida, we want to really highlight the num the, all events that are taking place here to celebrate Reggae music. And... We have a number of events that have been taking place over the years, and we wanted to bring them pretty much under an umbrella and just highlight all the efforts that are, that are being take, taking place here um, to support. So, IrishTimesTV.com is an amalgamation, it's a partnership between IrishTimes.com, which is Sir Dreamy Riley, who has been around and doing his thing for many, many years, and Bar Vision Films, which is myself and my husband. I'm Judith Fallon Reed. My husband is Michael Brown. Some of you know him as Barry. And um, we formed Ari Times TV because we wanted something uniquely Caribbean. And notice I said Caribbean, not Jamaican. So right now there's a lot of Jamaican programming on there, but trust me, we're working towards so much more. And the programs include everything from food programs to cooking, to travel. Uh, I see Caribbean Edge here. Caribbean Edge is on Ari Times TV. And we are available online, aritimestv.com. But we're also on Roku and Amazon. So if you have Roku or Amazon Fire Stick, make sure you download aritimestv.com. But I'm here to tell you about the laundry list of things that we have planned for Reggae Month. And I do have just a handful of handouts that I can give you. We have stuff like reggae and poetry. Mr. Malachi Smith is here. And reggae and poetry, um, the CG will be involved in that. Steve Higgins will be involved in that. We have quite a few celebrities and some not so celebritous who are going to be taking reggae songs and doing them as poetry. And that's one of our big things that we're having. We have vintage moments where we're going to be showing some vintage reggae stuff like the Reggae Soca Awards from, I think, 2004. You have the Gospel Reggae Revolution, where we're going to be showing some gospel music and talk about, um, you know, when reggae hit gospel, because it was a big thing in the church in Jamaica. Nobody did want to play gospel reggae, and as a matter of fact, they used to pray over the gospel reggae, minister them for the devil to come out of them. So we want to talk about that, and we have some of that going on. The evolution of dub poetry, which will be hosted by Mr. Malachi Smith, will feature several of our well-known, um, newer dub poets. And I have to say newer because every time I said dub poet, everybody thinks of the same three or four that we all know, but there are some fantastic, amazing dub poets that we met when we went down to Jamaica to do the poets tour. And that incorporates some of them talking about dub poetry and doing their poetry. We're going to have features on people like Lady C, the South Florida reggae radio pioneer. She is the one who pioneered the whole idea of putting reggae on radio around here. Uh, reggae and jerk, connecting the Grace Jamaican Jerk Festival and reggae music. Some chats with people like Eddie Edwards, some of the concert, to show you that reggae music is not just music it's attached to our food, because we don't do anything without eating. And when we eat, we have to have food and reggae music. And um, Eugene Gray, the American roots of Jamaican music, we're going to be able to show that. Reggae Generations, where we're going to feature some legacy families. Some that you may not even know about, because everybody knows about, like, Morgan's heritage. But a lot of you may not know about Billy Vernon and his family from Montego Bay, because sometimes Mobe get left out. So we're going down to the bay. And then, of course, the CG Salute to Reggae Music, his concert, will also be on Airy Times TV. So we have a lot that's going to be happening. I want you to check out Airy Times TV if you have not yet visited the platform, please do. You can just go on it right now and just 
sign up so that you get notification of all the great things that are going to be happening. We have 24-7 programming, so people in across the pond can check us out while we are sleeping on this side. And I just want to mention our partners and our sponsors, Island Space Caribbean Museum. They've partnered with us, and they'll be providing that beautiful environment for us to film a lot of what we're going to be doing. Safari International Shipping, who has been serving South Florida and shipping for more than 25 years. And JN Money, always, always supporting the community. We all know JN Money, providing the best money remittance service back to Jamaica and the Caribbean. And, uh, of course, our media partner, Jamaicans.com, who will be rebroadcasting some of the features that we'll be carrying. So I want to say thank you so much. Bless up. You know, we couldn't name Irie Times and not do something with reggae. That would have been sacrilegious. And so as Irie Times, IrieTimes.com, IrieTimesTV.com, we want to welcome you to watch some of the programming this, as, that we're going to have on for the month of February. Thank you very much. Bless up. And CG, all yours.